So now let's see how we can work around with Notch Filter inside of Audacity. So to work around with Notch Filter, first of all, I'm going to go around into the spectrogram view of my audio wave file. So I'm just going to go around right here, click on the option and choose spectrogram so that I can view uh, the different herders right here. So if I were to uh, go and then click here with my mouse cursor and press the space bar to play, this is how it is actually heard. So if I were to go around and press Ctrl A to select everything, now I can apply the knots filter right here. So to apply knots filter, I'm going to go around into effect right here and you can see knots filter is an option. Once you click on it, you can delete off a certain frequency. So let's say I want to delete off uh, around 1000 hertz right here. So you can choose the value reduction rate as well. So let me just select two right here. So once you do that, you can press OK and you'll be able to see that that range of audio waveform has been deleted. And now if I were to play this, you don't hear that range of audio. Similarly, you can go around and then you can delete off other part as well. So I'm going to go around right here. Let's go to, uh, let's say, Knox filter right here. So if I were to go around into 2000 hertz right here, press OK, then that portion is deleted as well. So you can see that this is the 2000 hertz range right here, and this is 1000 hertz range just like this. So if I were to press the play button, this is how it is heard. And that is how you can work around with, with Knox filter inside of Audacity. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.